Oh my god. I was about to sneeze again. Before starting this recording, I sneezed twice. And I was about to sneeze again. <laughs> How's it going, Beast Nation? We're back with some more Pokemon Sun Randomizer Nuzlocke. In the last episode, guys, we made our way here to, uh, I believe, I'm like 98% sure this is Lana's trial. Uh, and we just, uh, we only got the first splash encounter or whatever. Uh, oh my god, I completely forgot to write down Brooklyn Hill, the cadaver that we caught. Again, that's, I'm pretty sure, Brook, whatever it's called, Brooklyn Hill, whatever. I'm gonna put however I think it's spelled, even though I'm 100%... Sure that it's spoiled it wrong, but it's okay. <laughs> um, but I'm pretty sure it's legal. I, I stood in my cadaver. I just wrote Brooklyn Hill. Uh, cadabra. Good thing I remember. Good thing I remembered. But this episode will continue with the trial, I guess. Uh, I don't know exactly where we're supposed to go. Ah. Here's an item. With a rev v v uh, Allergies suck, all right. Okay, here's more grants. Actually, I am kind of curious. No items? No, no items. I actually am kind of curious as to what else we could have potentially got. Because we caught a Kadabra. The freaking splash encounter. I don't know. Oh, dang it. I don't, I don't know what... Uh, I don't know if we could have been able to capture it, but... Uh, it was a freaking Samurott. That would have been very nice for the team. Uh, that I think then I probably would have taken out Dumbo for that. I'm sorry, what, what was your name? Of course, Danny. It is a lovely name, just lovely. Now look over there, do you see that? Whatever's kicking up such lovely splashes must be rather big. A strapping young swimmer, perhaps, or an amazing Pokemon specimen. Oh yeah? Well, let me see. Let me go check it out. What do we got here? Well, they dispersed. And now we just have another, what should be a wishy-washy, but it's a Bidoof. I like Bidoof. Not a lie. I like Bidoof. It's a pretty cool Pokemon. I forgot. I am very low in HP. Even so, I think we could have lived, but, you know, better safe than sorry. Let's just heal up. With the, let's let's heal up with the super potion. I don't know what what this guy's gonna go for. Again, better safe than sorry. Let's use the super potion. Defense, that's totally fine. My dragon rage goes through that 100%. You're calling for help. Please don't get the help that you. Okay. Okay. Wow. That is huge help. Yeah. Okay. We know who we're taking out first then. Jeez! Hyperfine, that's gonna hurt. You're gonna roar me out. Who's gonna come in? That is horrible! Why? No, no, uh... <laughs> like, literally any other one would have been fine. You send, you go out to the one dude that can actually annihilate me. All Might, come out. Jeez. Don't roar again, please. Dude, that, we would have lost weight right there. Another defense scroll. I need to go for... Ooh, what do I go for? Do I try to take out the Raikou? Or do I double kick the Bidoof, hoping I one-shot? I don't think I... No, I'm, I'm not going to one-shot the Bidoof. I think I have a better chance of one-shotting um, the Raikou. What is more damage? 50. Okay. I'm gonna go for, for a flame. You do have a chance to burn too, right? Or no? No. You just raise my my stat. Let's go for a flame charge on the Raikou. Dang it, doesn't kill. Okay, Bidoof's defense curling again. This should allow me to outspeed uh, Raikou now, but I'm still gonna heal. Because I am very, very low. 
and I don't want to risk it. I think I do outspeed already, Raikyu, though. Okay. I should I should outspeed the Bidoof, still. Okay, just don't be Sway. This is fine, just don't be Sway. Okay, perfect, that's fine. Totally fine. That's totally fine. I'm 100% Does Ancient Rock hit both? It doesn't, okay. That does kind of suck. We can go for a Lava Plume. Oh, Lava Plume hits all of them, that's dope. Okay, cool. I did, not know, I did not know Lava Plume did that, but that's awesome. This Bidoof is insane. He calls for help, Raikou shows up. <laughs> he, he, he's just calling for help and Raikou shows up. Not, not another Bidoof, not, you know, something else. Not even a Babero, no, Raikou. Jeez, man. Uh, no, nah, we don't need Aqua Ring. I like the moveset we have. I like the moveset we have. Keep old moves. Jeez. Bro, that does nothing to us. And that was a crit. I swear if another Raikou comes. Bro, what? Stop it. I mean, he can't touch us. He has to roar again. But now I have to earth power the Shikles out of Raikou here. He leered. Good. I'm so glad he didn't roar. But this should one-shot Raikou. It doesn't one-shot Raikou. That's actually crazy. I really thought it would have one-shot. But that's fine because we can go for another Lava Plume and take both of them out in one go. Ha! Losers! Out of my face. Wow. <laughs> wow. And Tommy gets some levels. Dude, everyone's getting levels. I'm feeling a lot more safer about my levels. It began to rain. Oh my. So it was just, so it was another witchy washing that was kicking up all that water. <laughs> How unfortunate. It wasn't a strapped young swimmer after all. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me. Jeez. Oh my word. Now what is that? Even more furious splashing. It sounds as big as a were lord. It might just be another Pokemon, but maybe, just maybe, we'll be lucky enough to find a spry young swimmer floundering in the water and, and in need of saving. Why do you want to find someone potentially drowning? That is pretty uh, odd and just weird. That's what you're looking for right now. Oh wait, the, the, the mighty character. Really? Oh dear. You won't be tricked easily, Danny. But we are near the sea. If that's if that splashing sound is coming from the sea, then I wonder what is causing it. And now and now it is raining as well. The rain will boost the power of any water type moves by half again. Could those splashes be caused by some Pokemon whose moves are now growing ever stronger in the falling rain? I actually do want to go back to battle these other trainers because I think there's two, three trainers that we have to battle. And the way I see it, it's like, you know, it's better better that I just battle them now rather than later. Just to get them out of the way and for experience, you know what I mean? So let's battle this dude over here. And just because, you know, I, I feel like that's another thing as to why I fail. Uh, Nuzlocke's why I've uh, lost Nuzlocke's in the past is that I, I skip I tend to skip a decent amount of trainers Eventually easy easy we can lift any hit that you uh, dish out and uh, We can do good damage to you So an easy dragon rage Hiya! And then a sand team should 100% take you out Are we out here avoiding? Please take it out. Thank you. Thank you. I th did, did she have two Pokemon? Did she have two? She does. A Marini. We can stay in. Ooh, it's a shiny. Bro, that's a nice shiny. That was actually one of the, like, I think I mentioned it, but that's one of the reasons why I kind of wanted to increase the shiny rate a little bit. Um... 
Just so I can see these shinies. So I can see what uh, a shiny Marini is, you know, for example. You know, just so I can see what their shinies look like. Literally main reason why I wanted to do that. But then it, it like it kind of backfired in the sense of now I don't I don't want to use the the shiny rule. Obviously, if my first encounter is a shiny, then that's just you know like best of both worlds, right? So that is a possibility that we can just get our first encounter to be a shiny. But if we encounter a shiny in the wild, uh, there's no shiny claws because I messed with the shiny settings, and I don't want to do that. No, leave me alone. I want to battle trainers. I don't want to be freaking wasting my... Th Ooh, Starly. That would have been a nice encounter, too. I mean, it would have gone to the box immediately, but... Mainly because I already have my, my flying type already. Mm. The other trainers were on the other side? There was two, I think, right? The guy fishing... Right here, and then there's this other lady over here. How are we on health? We're fine, we're fine. I actually might even, I might also need to, to go uh, heal up before we take on this. I think it's the last one already, that's why. I believe it, it's the last one. Glaceon user Hubert. He's sending a needle around. How's it going, Dumbo? All right, alrighty. Take a Dragon Rage. Actually, I could have just sand sand tuned you, and it probably. Well, this might one shot too, right? No, it's not. It's not. You're level 18. I thought you were level. I thought you were like uh, maybe 15 or something. 16 might have killed, maybe. Maybe let them on one or something. You avoided the attack. Must be nice, bro, to be able to just avoid attacks like that, dog. But that's it. You're done. I feel like Santum would have probably one shot too. Just because it's a Nidoran. Uh I'm what? I was five levels above it? Stab. Super effective. Hmm. I'm curious now. Would it would it have killed? I wonder. The last trainer though. And then we'll quick we'll quickly go heal. <clears throat> and, oh, how's it going, dude? <laughs> What was it, Collector Maiko? Mik Mikiko? 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 Mikiko, I think it's Mikiko. I don't know. <laughs> uh, Corefish, so it's still... I should still be able to take you out, but... I've always full health. I do kind of want to switch out. Tommy should 100% be able to handle it. <clears throat> and a Thundershock won't one-shot. But maybe two it one shots. I do not. Wow, Tommy. I'm sorry for uh, underestimating you. Wow, very very sorry about that. But I'll go heal up, guys, real quick. So I'll cut this part out, and then you know we'll be back over there with the um, with Lana do the last part. We're back. Um, but uh, we just got out of a battle a while ago. Wild encounter. There was a mammal swine, <laughs> and I'm leading with Jack. Did that much damage with the powder snow. I got so scared that we were going to lose Jack. I was going to just be devastated. But we quickly switched out into All Might and we ran away. <laughs> uh, but the mammal swine, for some reason, decided to predict a switch. And use Mud Slap on uh, All Might here, but All Might's, um, All Might's pretty good. But we'll heal up real quick. I just thought I just thought I should mention that because that was pretty scary. Pretty scary for me, man. Uh potion. We'll potion up the All Might here. And I think we do we need to potion up you or two potions up, yeah. Two potions. And it's actually perfect, bruh. Perfect. Okay. I think I think that was it, right? Yeah, it is. Now we just have Lana here. And this is where we get the Totem's Den. Danny, you've come all this way with me. <clears throat> That's right. Didn't you notice? You passed through the captain's gates by my side. Which means that you will undergo my trial. 
To clear my trial, you must defeat the great totem Pokemon known as the Lord of the Ocean. That spray of water you can see there, that is where you will probably find the totem. And perhaps those Wishiwasa you battle against will also want their revenge. Defeat whatever comes at you and prove your strength to me. And remember that you cannot catch any Pokemon here unless you complete my trial. So let the trial begin. Did we get one of the... Did we get an encounter in that den? I honestly do not remember. I feel like we killed it, right? I feel like one of my Pokemon killed it. But where was the splashes? Over here? Okay. Here we are. I didn't check who I was leaving with. Or like I didn't check like if I wanted to leave with uh, Jack here. But I guess we are. We're leaving with Jack. Please don't be an ice type. That's all I gotta say. Just please don't be an ice type. Or a fairy. Quassel. That's actually fine. <clears throat> totally fine. What is that gonna be though? Please be like speed. <laughs> Dude! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you very much. Wow. Okay, what, what, what can he hit? He can't have... I guess he could potentially have a water type move. But like, not one that's gonna just obliterate me. Considering how I'm part dragon. Uh, but <laughs> that's hilarious how I called it, like speed. Because like, literally the speed doesn't do much for him at... Wow, that does a lot of damage. Please don't, don't work, don't work. It's probably gonna work, but don't work. Dang it. Scolipede, okay. We could go into Dre. I will go out into Dre. I'm gonna go into Dre, I'm gonna Lava Plume. Take out the Scolipede, hopefully, and then do some damage to the Crustle. But well, that's cool because we also changed the weather. Okay, what is uh, Crosser gonna do though? Another bug bite. We should eat that up. It is a lot of damage though. Like, I do kind of want to take out the Crosser with just an Earth Power. But I think the Lava Plume will take it out, right? I'm pretty sure it'll take it out with the amount of HP that it's at. Wow, they both live, like, on, like, single HP. Oh, that's fine. We win. Okay, cool. Dope. It's over. Thank you, Groudon. <laughs> I mean, Dre. Thanks to Dre. Thanks to Dre. <laughs> of course, Skull Defeat. Of course. You loser. You, could, you couldn't face going down with the buddy that called for help. And you know what? That's fine. That's fine. Jack gets a level up, which is very, very nice. Sway gets a level up. Where's Tommy? Why couldn't Tommy get a level up? Taking Earth Power. Ugh. Yeah. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. I will take it. I will take it. Mirror shot. What does that move do? The user lets loose a flash of energy at the target from its polished body. This may also lower the target's accuracy. That's not bad because it's special. I think I might get rid of Magnet Bomb just because my, my physical attack just does nothing. I'm gonna get rid of it, yeah. Even though it's a very low accuracy, <laughs> I'll take it. Oh no, you evolve at 24! You're not like, you're not like a, like, a Dratini. And like, I thought about it, like, once, once I saw Gibble uh, level up to 24, I was like, huh, why does that number fit for, for Jack here? And why does it, why does it just fit? Because it evolves at 24. Wow. Pretty cool, so we gotta get bite! Layout, change! But nice, so get by. In rare cases, it molts and sheds its skills. Medicine containing its skills as an ingredient will make a weary body feel invigorated. Huh, nice. 
Nice, nice, nice. But he learns a new Dragon Claw? Dual Chop. Wow. What do you forget though? What does it do? What's the damage? Does 40. Oh, the target is hit tw hit twice in a row. But like, is it like bang bang? Or is it like bang and then I have a chance to hit twice or something? I don't know. I don't know. But I'll get rid of takedown just because I don't I don't like I don't like recoil. And I do like sun attack. So I'm getting rid of takedown. I especially don't like recoil damage in like nuzlocks. <clears throat> but nice, nice, nice. So that was it. So that means we could get another encounter here in this area. This is potentially another encounter because I think it's a Brooklyn Hill Totem's Den or something like that. Very well done, Danny. Please come back this way. I must say that I find myself at an impasse here. I don't know what that word means. All of the wishy-washy that I so dil diligently trained up here, up were defeated, and that is very frustrating. But of course, I cannot let your completion of my trial go uncelebrated. You were amazing, Danny. Truly impressive. Please take this. We got the watery deep. You know, I still don't know exactly who to give like these um, Z crystals to, because I know I haven't done it. Don't get me wrong. I know I haven't done it, right? And I haven't given anyone a Z type, a uh, Z move. You do know what, what it is, though, don't you? Yeah, it's the Wario Z. I know what it is. Oh. <laughs> she did that face. <laughs> That's not all I can offer you. Here, this is the Lana original. One of my one of my own handmade fishing rods. Oh, nice. Well, I can fish now. I love fishing. When you want to fish for a Pokemon, look. Oh, yeah, look for the. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I remember now. I almost forgot, but I remember now. And dive balls. Bro, Lana? Is very very nice. Thank you. By the way, did you know I, I once ruled in a red Gyarados? Did you really? Well, what do you think? I don't think you did. You did a fine job, Dan, today. I shall see you back at the Pokemon Center in round five. Uh oh no 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 no! I want to catch an encounter. Never mind. You should have. Dang it! We're already 26 minutes in. Wow! No encounter. We'll get an encounter in the next episode. <laughs> you guys will have to wait. I don't. <laughs> So other than that, if you guys are already, if you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like down below and subscribe to join the Beast Nation. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.